The Moxie Hotel is part of a new urban district in Edinburgh named New Fountain Bridge and is being developed primarily using CLT. By adopting sustainable materials and combining them with modern methods of construction, we have the opportunity to address our contribution to the climate crisis. We also have the opportunity to help stabilise and protect our future world. Cross laminated timber is a massive timber component. It's essentially a large slab of timber which is made up of dimensional lamellas. It provides the opportunity for timber to really stretch its capability of how it can be utilised. So, correspondingly, you can make much larger structures or structures with much larger spans. But it's still a relatively new product in many respects, coming about in the, in the 80s. Um, and it's challenging the norms in terms of construction procurement and regulatory requirements. So construction productivity has stagnated at best. There's a necessity to build more, particularly in urban environments due to population increases. However, construction also is a net contributor to climate change and we are in the midst of a climate crisis. So correspondingly, if we actually increase the level of productivity through our current utilisation of materials, we're only going to accelerate ourselves towards that relationship. However, Using timber in construction and using products such as mass timber and cross laminated timber, which acts as a carbon sink, um, can change the model of that and make the built environment actually perform in our benefit. So we have to think more dynamically about how we improve productivity and not just think about output, but also think about what we're putting into it. And that's why timber and products such as CLT are definitely the answer to the manufacture of the future built environment. We started construction of the first phase of a new Fountain Bridge project in April 2019. From a construction point of view, there are many benefits from using CLT off-site manufactured elements rather than on-site um, traditional trades. On this project in particular, we managed to construct 262 CLT structured bedrooms in approximately 16 uh, working weeks. Our best um, output was 20 bedrooms in just over two days when the weather was on our side. Use of CLT has major environmental benefits. Each metre cubed of CLT locks in 676 kilograms of CO2. To put that into perspective, a 200 bedroom Moxo Hotel has approximately 2,000 metres cubed of CLT, which works out at 1.3 million kilograms of CO2 that's locked in. That's the equivalent of 883 return plane journeys from Munich to New York or the run-in emissions of 767 cars uh, for a year. Our industry has to recognise and be responsible for not only the extensive waste that it currently produces, but also the materials and the construction methods used to assemble the places that we live, learn and work. Here at Construction Scotland Innovation Centre, we are actively promoting the benefits of cross-laminated timber, also known as CLT, especially the economic potential if CLT could be homegrown and mainstreamed in Scotland. This was emphasised through the recent CLT learning journey to the new Moxie Hotel development in Edinburgh that was supported by McLaughlin and Harvey, Edinburgh Napier University, Fairhurst and Cumming and Co Architects. Through the visit, we offered industry, public sector and academia the opportunity to learn from the overall construction experience, the challenges and the opportunities of building with CLT. Let's not forget, despite being low-tech, trees are still the most powerful tool in removing carbon dioxide from our atmosphere. <laughs> <laughs>